A new law in Alabama aims to protect people with disabilities. Yeah, it requires police to be trained to learn how to interact with people who have sensory needs. WVTM 13's Emma Owen is live in Helena for us tonight. Emma, many departments have already been going through this training even before the law passed. Yeah, Jarvis, that's right. The Helena Police Department being one of them. Chief Brad Flynn explains how this has improved interactions between police officers and members of the community. And uh, it is proven to save lives. We saved lives less than two weeks after we rolled ours out in Helena. This life-saving training required for all police officers in Alabama as the Cade Noah Act is now in effect. Alabama law enforcement officers must now participate in at least one hour of training every other year, teaching them how to interact with people who have sensory needs. These are individuals that might have PTSD. They might have had a stroke before. They might be on the autism spectrum. Dr. Julian Maha is an emergency medicine physician and founder of Culture City. His nonprofit organization specializes in supporting people who have sensory needs. Among the work they do here, providing training for first responders. Actually in, this, in Salt Lake City, uh, back in actually 2020. And then after that, very quickly, it was adopted by all the state troopers in the state of Alabama. The state of Alabama was actually the first state in the U.S. to actually mandate that every single state trooper in the state went through our training. And Educational opportunities Maha and Flynn agree have been positive. Training has made the difference between life and death because all too often law enforcement may accidentally uh, interpret an individual with a developmental disability as, as being intoxicated or maybe possibly high on drugs or something like that. So the, we teach them what to look for and then how to safely engage and best help that individual. Now, as for the inspiration behind this law, Dr. Maha says it was inspired by Representative Lee Holsey's son, who has autism. This law aiming to create a safer world for him and others. Live in Helena, Emma Owen, WVTM 13.